today I'm going to showcase the procedure of replacing the motherboard on a Samsung WA95W9 top loading washing machine. I like to start off with a disclosure that I'm not a certified technician and will not be holding responsibility if something bad happens if you choose to replicate my actions I perform in this video. To replace the motherboard you need a Phillips screwdriver and a replacement motherboard. A motherboard is also known as a PCB, printer circuit board or board. To note from performing online research, there seems to be two types of motherboard for this model of washing machine. My recommendation is to disassemble the washing machine to the extent that you can see the motherboard and the connector on the most left side before buying a replacement board. The only difference between the two types of motherboard is the most left connector and whether it's got 4 pins or 7 pins. To start, off and remove the mains plug. Then open the door and remove the two white rubber grommets. Their placement is currently showcased with red circles. My grommets have fallen out hence why they're not present. After removing the rubber grommets, unscrew the two screws that were underneath the rubber grommets. If this is the first time removing the screws, the screws might be a bit stuck. Once both screws have been unscrewed, pull the front panel towards you and flip it upside down. Now undo four more screws. The placement of these screws needed to be undone is now being highlighted with red circles. Keep these screws separate from the screws you earlier unscrewed as they're different and cannot be mixed. Now lift the black part towards you and flip it upside down. Put aside the front face here. Currently being pointed out by my fingers is the six connectors you need to disconnect. Each connector has a clip. An example of the clip is shown with a red circle. You cannot simply pull the connector to disconnect it. You need to push on the top portion of the clip to unlatch it and pull on the connector at the same time to disconnect the connector. Next, unwrap the cable from the black housing. Remove the plastic protective film from the replacement motherboard. Replace the old motherboard with the new motherboard and route the wire. Now plug in all six connectors back. I would recommend plugging the washing machine at this point to test whether the replacement motherboard works. After which, unplug the washing machine. Now flip the part upside down and place it on the front face here. To note that the bottom of the black part features two tabs that goes beneath supports in the front face here. Then screw back in the four screws into the four holes, flip it upside down, place it on the bottom lip and bash in the top section with your hand. And don't forget to screw back in the first two screws you undid and place the white grommets over them. And that's the whole procedure. Thank you for watching.